When I was researching for the second book in my health trilogy, Neuron, Smart Wellness Made Easy, I became particularly fascinated by the gut-brain axis and the gut microbiome. And I mean, jaw-droppingly fascinated because the science in this area is exploding. And did you know that scientists in that field now consider the gut microbiome to be the discovery of a new organ because the microbiome, the gut microbiome is so essential to brain and body health. It's like literally we cannot function in any way properly if your gut bacteria is not balanced and you have not got high diversity. And now it's all about diversity because the latest recommendations are saying that we need to have a, an intake, a weekly intake of 30 plants per week. So 30 different types of fruits, vegetables, nuts, seeds, beans, uh, herbs per week. That's a lot, right? But that is what our gut ecosystem needs. And so there you have it. It's a complicated chemical factory and it needs prebiotics, probiotics, um, in the form of natural plants. So I've just strolled out to my local little community garden and I've been working with the farm shop to start getting weekly delivery of many, many different types of food. So instead of getting a big bag of, you know, six types of apple, I might get less apples, but I'll get an apple, banana, pear, kiwi fruit, peach, um, just really boosting diversity. And in addition, there are other ways of boosting um, so our bacteria, so through probiotics, things like fermented vegetables in particular are amazing. Live yogurts, because they're putting bacteria in, whereas the prebiotic fiber in the fruits and vegetables is the stuff that feeds the bacteria uh, and encourages it to thrive in a diverse environment. But in addition to that, just being outdoors exposes you to bacteria petting your dog exposes you to bacteria so there's lots of different ways that you can keep these things boosted and healthy and all of this the more i'm digging into this research the more obvious it is that pretty much all the guidelines are ridiculously out of date right now they're not fit for purpose in many places in in many instances you know the fitness advice the dietary advice it's just not right now that the latest science is showing a lot more in information you see the sea behind me not sure you can it's a beautiful beautiful day on the south coast of england so i encourage you to increase the diversity of your fruit and veg and plant-based intake immediately